OK, so here we see the cir same circuit again. And this time, we're using this here, which is that optocoupler. So as that pulse wave is coming out of here, it's being switched between like two channels by, by this over here. Yeah? So it's going left and right, left and right. That in turn then goes back into the optocoupler, yeah? into the trigger of that. Yeah? And I've actually just done it on one side at the moment, which is this little lead coming in here, just in here. Uh, and so that comes back over the chip into that side okay, again. So that's, that's the other, other end of it. Yeah? And the rest of it is actually coming out here. So now what we're doing is this is like a, a kind of transistor type thing, you know. So we're pulsing, sending this pulse wave to the base of the transistor at the moment. That's going then, we're actually getting energy through this coil into the collector. And then the, the pulsed wave is then being pumped out into this fan over here, which is spinning around. Yeah. Okay. So that's the first part of the, where I'm at at the moment. So we've got this coming up here. We've also got a set of batteries over here, which are on charge um, from the circuit, which we've been charging up before. And I've also got ready for the next part, which is this optocoupler here, just above that, which will be actually used then to swap to switch the inputs of the battery. So then we're sending a pulse wave back and forth to two sets of batteries. That's the idea anyway. So we'll see how that pans out and how that comes along. Stay tuned and uh, I'll keep you posted.